Welcome back, beer tubers. Ryan here, back with another episode of San Diego Beer Vlog. Outside on a very, very hot, scorching day. Wanted something really refreshing to review, so we're gonna take a look at a beer from from Meat Killer, and this is their Spontan Wild Strawberry. This is a 7.7% ale brew of strawberries, Asian wine barrel. So this is a uh, one of their new sours out, and they did uh, a few different ones. I think you just did a regular base beer in wine barrels. They did a strawberry one. I think they did a cherry one. And there might have been a raspberry one too, but uh, let's uh, get this open and try it out and see how it is. Looks like a lot of carbonation coming out. Definitely want to see that. This is one of those bottles where you think they might have a cork in it, but it's it's not. It's just a cap only. This one was brewed at uh, De Proof, so it pours out a very very hazy orange. Good carbonation. You know, that head faded away real quickly. Maybe a touch of legs on the side of the glass. Bright white head. Definitely get a lot of strawberry on the nose. Um, a little bit of like a tart, lemony kind of sourness to it. Mostly a very sweet, almost floral strawberry nose. Maybe a touch of funkiness underneath. But uh, smells pretty good. Let's dig in. Cheers. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Good tartness on it. First sip wasn't terribly complex. It's it's got uh, definitely a good strawberry character. Not as much as Cascade Strawberry. That beer is just loaded with it. This one still has a nice strawberry character to it though. Up front, you're hit with a lot of really nice tart lemon sourness to it. That that's the you know along with that carbonation, they kind of hit right away up front. Midway through, you get a little bit of sweetness in there, a little bit of like it's not an overly dry sour. You get like almost a touch of sweetness in the middle. The sweetness kind of comes from a little bit of maybe a malt character left. No, mostly from that uh, strawberry character is definitely there. And it finishes with a just a slight bit of a funkiness to it. it it's a really nice, very light mouthfeel, very refreshing type of beer. Uh, not the most complex sour out there. Strawberry character could be a little more involved in there. A little more intense would be nice. Uh, the strawberry's got... It, it definitely tastes like a you know real deal strawberry. It just has a little bit of a, a slightly kind of off character. It's really hard to describe. It's maybe like a slightly kind of medicinal character that doesn't get quite to that kind of really like fresh like you're eating a strawberry character. But um, it's a it's a solid sour. It's it's a very pricey beer. Fortunately, it's. I think I paid around 15 bucks for the small little bottle, which is only, uh, what, 375 milliliters. So it's a little on the pricey side. Um, worth trying, because you don't see too many strawberry sours out there. There's only a, a handful that I've been able to find. So Yeah, I'm going to give a, a B to the uh, Mikeller Spontan Wild Strawberry. Uh, if you've never had a strawberry sour, you know, pick it up, check it out. Uh, just not, you know, the most complex sour out there, but solid stuff. So. It's going to wrap it up. Until next time, please comment, subscribe. Cheers.